8-Bit Dylan. Time for the intro to my videos. Just make weird noises with your mouth. Hey guys, if you're a huge fan of RuPaul's Drag Race and a huge fan of reality show television like I am, I've got a fun video for you today. If you guys don't know what Brant Steel is, it is an awesome survivor, big brother, reality show simulator, and I decided to put 20 different RuPaul's Drag Race drag queens into it, and we're gonna see exactly what's gonna happen. Who will come out on top? among the bottoms. I'm kidding. I'm kidding! <laughs> so as you guys can see, I've got a good mixed bag of drag queens here from all the different seasons of RuPaul's Drag Race. For the Glitter Tribe, we've got Adore Delano, Courtney Act, Detox, Ginger Minge, Latrice Royale, Manila Luzon, we got Naomi Smalls, Nina Flowers, Trixie Mattel, and Willem. And for the Glamour Tribe, we've got Alaska Thunderfuck, Alyssa Edwards, Katya Kimchi, Laganja Estranja, Pandora Box, Shangela, Tatiana, Trinity Taylor, and Valentina. So we're already starting off with a twist. The tribes are to collect as many supplies as they can from a large ship. However, while the tribes are busy gathering items, several yards from the ship are two color-coded knots. Members from each tribe can choose to dive in and swim to the ropes to untie them. The first person to untie the tribe's knots will release a toolkit for their tribe. And the Glamour tribe has won that reward, but Miss Nina Flowers has found a legacy advantage. So we're gonna see all these lovely relationships throughout this entire thing to see who's been bonding with who. We got Trixie and Latrice fighting, Trixie and Manila fighting. We've got Naomi and Latrice fighting, but then for some reason coming back together. There just seems to be a lot of craziness that's going on around here. And over on the Glamour Tribe, let's see what we got. Ooh, girl, that Valentina shot, though. It is like... <laughs> What did I do to her? The Blue Lagoon Bustle. It's time for our first immunity challenge. Tribes start out on the beach with their best bikini wear, with each tribe running into the ocean, swimming out to a net obstacle, climbing over it, going over a barrel roll, and swimming to a platform to retrieve some keys. Three players from each tribe then solve their tribe's puzzle in the form of an awesome pair of heels. And just like that, it appears that the Glitter Tribe has won immunity, so they also won Flint. Let's see who's gonna get voted out. It seems like after all the alliances and fighting, there's three people who are potentially gonna be leaving this tribal council. Valentina, Laganja, Estranja, and Trinity Taylor, let's find out who. It's time for tribal council. If anyone has a hidden immunity idol and would like to play it, now is the time to do so. It seems like no one has. Our first vote is for Trinity. Second vote, Valentina. Third vote, Trinity. Fourth vote, Trinity. 5th vote Laganja, 6th vote Laganja, 7th vote Laganja, 8th vote Laganja, 9th vote Laganja, and I'm so sorry, Laganja Estranja, you are the first person voted out of Drag Queen Survivor. I feel very attacked! Relax. Ooh girl, let's get this tea. Who voted for who? Alyssa came for her, Kim came for her, Shangela, Tatiana, Trinity came for her. Oh my god, even Valentina came for her girl. On to the next round. It's time for the next immunity challenge, the Serpent Turf. Basically, they gotta get a cage and a ring and something. Immunity, let's find out who won. And it looks like it's the Glitter Tribe again. I'm so sorry, Glamour Tribe, but you're gonna have to go back to Tribal Council. Oh my, it seems like the next big targets for this elimination are Valentina, Trinity Taylor, and Kim Chi. Let's find out what exactly is gonna happen. Let's read the vote, shall we? Episode number two. First vote goes to Trinity. Second vote, Valentina. Third vote, Kim. Fourth vote, Valentina. Fifth vote, Valentina. Sixth vote, Kim. Seventh vote, Trinity. Eighth vote, Valentina. And with that, I'm so sorry, Valentina. You have been voted out of Drag Queen Survivor. She was frowning on the way out and you couldn't even see it. Damn, all these people coming for her. Alaska, Alyssa, Katya, Kim, Pandora. Oh my. Here are our tribes going into episode number three. But plot twist, a third tribe has been formed and members of this tribe will have to start from scratch. They got a new camp. They got to make a new shelter. They got to make a new fire. They don't even get to carry their own types of makeup. They got to make that shit from rocks and berries and all that kind of stuff. So here are our new tribes. We've got the new glitter tribe, which is Detox, Ginger Minge, Katya, Pandora Box, Trinity Taylor, and Trixie Mattel. We got the Glamour Tribe, which is Alyssa Edwards, Courtney Act, Kim Chi, Latrice Royale, Manila, and Willem. And then the Contour Tribe, which is Adore Delano, Alaska Thunderfuck, Naomi Smalls, Nina Flowers, Shangela, and Tatiana. 
it's time for us to see who's gonna win this very next immunity challenge. And it seems like the next challenge involves an obstacle course that does involve the drag queens having to take awkward photos in front of the bulges of random male models that they bring in to help promote their Andrew Christian underwear so that way RuPaul can get those dollars. And it seems like there are two tribes who have won this immunity, the Glitter Tribe and the Glamour Tribe. I'm so sorry, Contour Tribe, but you're going to Tribal Council. Ooh, and these alliances on this Contour Tribe. You better watch out, Nina and Alaska. You guys are the targets to be leaving this time. And apparently, at some point, Naomi has found the hidden immunity idol for their tribe. Will she use it today, though? I don't know. But here are the votes. First vote, Alaska. Second vote, Nina Flowers. Third vote, Nina Flowers. Fourth vote, Nina Flowers. Fifth vote, Nina Flowers. And I'm so sorry, Nina Flowers. The tribe has spoken. Everyone on the tribe came for her. Everybody. And Nina Flowers has given her legacy advantage to Naomi. So Naomi is in a really good spot. Naomi's not only got a hidden immunity idol, but she's also got a legacy advantage. On to episode number four. And plot twist, there is an immunity challenge, but only one tribe is winning immunity. Both other tribes are gonna be going to tribal council as a group and voting one person out. And it does seem that the Glitter Tribe has won this immunity challenge. But it is time for this tribal council. Both tribes are together in this one tribal council, and Manila has found the hidden immunity idol for her tribe. But no one seems to play a hidden immunity idol, and it is time to read the votes. First vote, Willem. Second vote, Naomi. Third vote, Naomi. Fourth vote, Naomi. Fifth vote, no Naomi. Sixth vote, Naomi. Seventh vote, Naomi. Ooh, girl, you had all those advantages, but they were squandered. Naomi Smalls, I'm so sorry. You have been voted out of Drag Queen Survivor. Homegirl literally received 10 votes and Willem only got one vote. So Naomi Smalls has given her legacy advantage to Alaska. That contour tribe is looking real skinny, but things turn around in this immunity challenge because it does involve having to make people laugh in an audience that seems like they don't get any kind of jokes. And it seems like Glamour Tribe and Contour Tribe have won this immunity. So Glitter Tribe, your win streak is out and you are going to Tribal Council, honey. Ooh, girl, the targets for the Glitter Tribe seem to be Katya, Pandora Box, and Trinity Taylor. Who is going to be leading? Though. It is time for the Glitter Tribe Tribal Council, and Trinity Taylor seems to have the hidden immunity idol from the tribe, but doesn't play it. Girl, what are you thinking? You are possibly going to be leaving. Anyway, it's time to read the votes. First vote, Trinity Taylor. Second vote, Trinity Taylor. Third vote, Katya. Fourth vote, Katya. Fifth vote, Katya. Sixth vote, Katya. And I'm so sorry, Katya. But with that, you have been voted out of Drag Queen Survivor. Damn, Trixie, why are you voting your girl Katya out of this game? That's some shady ass shit. I guess she'll be saying all the way back to LA. On to episode number six. It's twist time. They are going to reform into two different tribes and someone is being exiled. And that person seems to be Trinity the Tuck. Taylor. Thankfully for Trinity Taylor though, she gets an awesome advantage. She can either choose to take an extra vote, a kit to design a fake a hidden immunity idol, or she can take an advantage for her tribe in the next tribal immunity challenge. And she chose to get the kit that helps her design a fake hidden immunity idol. You do you, Trinity. And these are the brand new tribes. We've got the Glitter Tribe, Alaska Thunderfuck, Courtney Act, Ginger Minge, Vanilla, Pandora, Shangela, and Trixie Mattel, and the Glamour Tribe, which is Adore Delano, Alyssa Edwards, Detox, Kinchi, Latrice Royale, Tatiana, and Willem. It's time for an immunity challenge, and in this one, it's going to involve actually snatching wigs off of bald caps. Girl, it is an art form, and apparently the Glamour Tribe knows what they're doing because they have won this immunity challenge, so I'm so sorry, Glitter Tribe, you're going to Tribal Council. And after seeing all the different alliances, such as Courtney Act, Ginger Minch, and Trixie Mattel all aligning with one another, it seems that the two targets this time are Shangela and Manila, but we're gonna find out what exactly is gonna happen. Like before, Manila has a hidden immunity idol, but it appears that Alaska has also found a hidden immunity idol. Nothing's played this time though, so let's read the votes. First vote is for Shangela. Second vote is for Manila. Third vote is for Manila. Fourth vote is for Manila. Fifth vote is for Manila, and I'm so sorry, Manila, but it seems like these votes recently have been block votes 
because it was a six to one vote and I'm so sorry Manila. You are off the island and you are out of Drag Queen Survivor. That feeling when everyone snatches your wig. Why couldn't you do this in the immunity challenge? Why? We are down to the final 14 as we go into episode number seven. I'm not sure who's gonna win this. If you have any predictions, put it down in the comments down below on who you think is gonna take the cake. And congratulations to the Glamour Tribe. You have won this reward challenge. You have won the amazing makeup that is the most orange shade that you could possibly find, provided by the lovely Coco Montrese. Thank you so much, Coco, for providing this reward today. Worry about what's going on over there with that same makeup you've been running on the runway every single time. Girl, look how orange you fucking look, girl. And they just keep the good times rolling because they win the immunity challenge, which does involve sucking tiny little beads out of a straw. Girl, they've got the most amazing sucking skills, I swear to God. But because of this, they are able to win this immunity challenge and I'm so sorry, Glitter Tribe, you're going to Tribal Council. So it seems like there's another alliance of Courtney Act, Ginger Minj, and Trixie Mattel who are all working together to try and get people out. And it seems like the big targets are Shangela and Pandora Box. So. Let's see what's gonna happen. And it's time for the Tribal Council. As before, Trinity has a hidden immunity idol, Alaska has a hidden immunity idol, and apparently Alaska has used her hidden immunity idol on Ginger Minj, so any votes cast against Ginger will not count. So, let's read the votes. First vote, Shangela. Second vote, Pandora. Third vote, Shangela. Fourth vote, Pandora. Fifth vote, Shangela. Sixth vote, Pandora. Seventh vote, Pandora. And I'm so sorry with the four to three vote. That was pretty close. Pandora Box, I'm so sorry. You are having to sashay away from Drag Queen Island. Interesting. So Alaska used her hidden immunity idol on Ginger, but Ginger must have backstabbed Alaska because she voted for Pandora Box, who obviously Alaska was working with. That's a, that's a lot to follow along with, but just go with it. It is time for the merge. And because of the merge, we are now in the gay as fuck tribe. Good luck, everybody. And I hope that you can survive. I was like dabbling through some of these relationships and it's really interesting that um, Latrice hates, and I mean extremely hates, Tatiana. And like there's some people that have like other extreme hatred toward each other and there's like unbreakable relationships, but like I just thought that was really funny. And thankfully for Tatiana, it was a individual immunity challenge and Tatiana was able to pick the best butt out of a lineup of butts. And because of this, Tatiana has won individual immunity and cannot be voted out during this tribal council. <gasps> and shocking, Alyssa Edwards is medically evacuated from the game due to a broken nail. I'm so sorry, Alyssa Edwards, you will be missed. And because Alyssa is no longer in the game, Tribal Council has been canceled. We are down to the final 12 in Drag Queen Survivor. And RuPaul announces this next immunity challenge, which does involve having to deep throat the biggest salami that they can on a table full of salamis, and Detox easily wins this one. Congratulations, Detox, you have one individual immunity. Because of all the different alliances that are happening between Courtney Act and Kim Chi, Adore and Shangela, Courtney Act, Ginger Minj, and Trixie Mattel, there are three main targets for tonight. Alaska Thunderfuck, Latrice Royale, and Kim Chi. As before, Trinity and Tatiana both have hidden immunity idols, and Tatiana uses her hidden immunity idol on Kim Chi, so any votes cast against Kim do not count. It's time for us to read the votes. First vote, which doesn't count, Kim Chi. Second vote, Kim Chi. Third vote, Kim Chi. Fourth vote, Kim Chi. Fifth vote, Latrice Royale. Wait, did I do that right? Yeah, no, no. Fifth vote, Kim Chi. Sixth vote, Latrice Royale. Seventh vote, Latrice Royale. Third, whatever vote, Latrice Royale. I'm shook. Then we got Alaska, 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 Alaska. Oh my God. That hidden immunity idol was used successfully. Kim would have left had that hidden immunity idol not been used. And Alaska, you have been voted out of Drag Queen Survivor. Okay, I have to see these votes. So Adora voted for Kim. Alaska voted for Kim. Latrice vo voted for Kim. Shangela voted for Kim. And Willem voted for Kim. Tatiana tried to get Latrice Royale out, but it didn't work. Because it seems like Trixie's alliance of Trixie and Ginger Minj and Courtney Act, or no, no, someone, I can't remember. They were able to get Alaska out. 
Interesting. So there's like three different alliances all fighting with each other. And one of them was able to sweep in and get one of the other people out. Alaska has given the legacy advantage to Adore Delano. It's time for episode 10. It's time for the immunity challenge. And it does involve making puppets of each other so they can get those last minute jab jokes in. And Ginger Minge wins this individual immunity. So because of all these alliances that have been made and everyone's turning on one another. And it seems like the alliance that got Alaska out last time is trying to go for Tatiana this time. So we're gonna see, there's like two alliances that have also kind of mushed together. I don't know what's gonna happen, but the main targets for this tribal council are Kim Chi, Tatiana, and Latrice Royale. I can't wait to see what's gonna happen. As always, Trinity has the hidden immunity idol, but does not play it. It's time to read the votes. First vote, Kim Chi. Second vote, Latrice Royale. Third vote, Latrice Royale. Fourth vote, Latrice Royale. Fifth vote, Tatiana, sixth vote Tatiana, seventh vote Tatiana, eighth vote Tatiana, ninth vote Tatiana, tenth vote Tatiana, and with that, Tatiana, the tribe has spoken. You were just too big of a target. She made a massive move, a massive move in the last tribal council, and that came back to bite her in the butt. I'm so sorry, Tatiana. Sashay away off this island, honey. So it seems like those two alliances that formed together were working together to get Tatiana out, and it worked. And we're finally down to the final 10. We started with 20 drag queens, 10 are left. I can't wait to see what's gonna happen. And it's time for the next individual immunity challenge, and it does involve a roast of RuPaul, and Latrice Royale goes in like, Oh my God, everyone in the audience was just gasping and gagging and Latrice Royale brought it. So Latrice Royale, you have won the individual immunity. And as you can see by these alliances that are being formed and all these different friendships, it seems like the target might be either Courtney Act, Willem, or Kim Chi. It's interesting because Kim Chi and Courtney Act have an alliance with each other, so one of them might be leaving. Just like before, Trinity has a hidden immunity idol and it is not used, so it's time to read the votes. First vote, Willem. Second vote, Courtney. Third vote, Courtney. Fourth vote, Willem. Fifth vote, Courtney. Sixth vote, Kim Chi. Seventh vote, Kim Chi. Eighth vote, Kim Chi. Ninth vote, Kim Chi. Tenth vote, Kim Chi. Wow. And with that, Kim Chi sashay away from drag queen island oh what so i mean i guess this is what happens when tatiana uses a hidden immunity idol to save kim chi kim chi gets a target on her back because obviously she needs to go Ooh, girl there are some drag queens in this season that are controlling things i don't want to name names but girl let's see who voted for who so detox voted for kim chi latrice voted for kim chi trinity trixie and willem these seem to be the top people in this season are Willem, Trixie, Trinity, and uh, Detox. Same with Latrice. They're all doing a great job of making sure that they're always on the top of the picking order and it's working for them. But in Survivor, the power dynamics always change. So on to the next episode. Episode number 12. And Latrice Royale comes in strong because at the immunity challenge, she wins her second consecutive individual immunity. And all she had to do was put on the most amount of eyelashes that she could, and she beat out the rest of the competitors. So it seems another strong alliance has kind of risen to power, and that is Adore Delano and Shangela, as well as this awesome, like, huge alliance that's been kind of in power this entire time, and they are going for Shangela. So the two main people are Shangela and Trinity Taylor, we're gonna see what's gonna happen. Will Adore Delano turn on this massive alliance to save her alliance partner, or will she work with Shangela to get out Trinity Taylor? As always, Trinity has the hidden immunity idol and does not play it, so it's time to read the votes. First vote, Trinity Taylor. Second vote, Shangela. Third vote, Trinity Taylor. Fourth vote, Shangela. Fifth vote, Shangela. Sixth vote, Trinity Taylor. Seventh vote, Shangela. Eighth vote, Shangela. And sadly, because of that, Shangela, you've been voted out of Drag Queen Survivor. Sashay away, mama. I love you, Shangela. Shangela and I go way back. I was an assistant for her when she came to Nebraska. She was amazing. So much fun to hang out with. You will be missed, Shangela. You will be missed. Ooh, that's gonna cause some uh, rifts in their group. 
Adore did turn on her massive alliance and vote for Trinity, as well as Ginger did as well. Ooh, these votes. Oh, my goodness. Again, if you haven't done it already, make sure to comment down below who you think is going to win this entire thing. Will it be Adore, Courtney Act, Detox, Ginger Minj, Latrice Royale, Trinity Taylor, Trixie Mattel, or Willem? It's time for this episode's individual immunity challenge, and it does involve having to give a speech live on air, and they have to plug in as many gay sex innuendo jokes as they can make. And it seems like Ginger Minj is just perfect at that, so Ginger Minj has won this individual immunity challenge. Ooh, these like relationships that have been formed these alliances people are like turning on each other working with each other it seems like Trixie Mattel has been kicked out of this massive alliance that she used to be a part of so that's not good for Trixie and it seems like uh, there's oh god I don't even know anymore there's this massive alliance against Trixie now but then there's also people who want Courtney act out oh what's gonna happen the two main targets are Courtney act and Trixie Mattel as always it seems like Trinity has the hidden immunity idol and decides not to use it. It's time to read the votes. First vote, Trixie Mattel. Second vote, Trixie. Third vote, Trixie. Fourth vote, Trixie. Fifth vote, Courtney. Sixth vote, Courtney. Seventh vote, Courtney. Eighth vote, Courtney. Ninth vote... Oh, wait, 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 wait. We have a tie. Oh, we have a tie between Courtney and Trixie. I forgot there's only eight people. So because the vote is in a deadlock, rocks will be drawn. <gasps> So if y'all don't know what Survivor is, whenever there's a tie, that means that the two people who could potentially have left, which are Courtney Act and Trixie Mattel, are actually safe now. And now the people who had voted for them all draw rocks to see who's gonna leave. Oh my God, this is intense. Let's see, who is going to lose the rock draw? <gasps> And Adore Delano has lost the rock draw. She lost to rocks. Wow. And she was looking pretty good this season as well. So I'm so sorry, Adore Delano. The tribe has spoken. Get on out of my island, girl. Party. Ooh, and these votes. Ginger turned on Trixie. Detox turned on Trixie. Adore turned on Trixie. And then uh, Courtney Act was probably most likely gonna vote for Trixie. And then these four voted for Courtney. Wow, so Adora has given her legacy advantage to Ginger Minge. Here are the final seven. It's time for episode 14. And it's time for the next individual immunity. And for this challenge, all they were given was a wig, two toothpicks, a hair comb, and a lot of lube. And they had to make the best looking outfit that they could make. And Courtney Act has won this individual immunity challenge. Which means we're about to head into this crazy situation that this tribal council is about to be this is not looking good for Trixie Mattel because of the fact that the other person who was the target during that tie last week has just won individual immunity and probably has the power to switch up some of the votes so we'll have to see it seems like Trixie is going to be the big target to go so it's between Trixie Mattel and Willem but you never know in this game again Trinity still has the hidden immunity idol and has not used it it's time to read the votes first vote Willem. Second vote, Trixie. Third vote, Trixie. Fourth vote, Trixie. Fifth vote, Trixie. And sadly, that's enough votes. The sixth vote. I'm so sorry, Trixie Mattel. You played a great game, but sadly, you made a lot of people mad. You were messing up some of the alliances, and you gotta go. So, Sashay away, Miss Trixie Mattel. That moment when legit everyone votes you out. We are down to our final six. I would not have guessed this final six at the very beginning. We've got Courtney Act, Detox, Ginger Minge, Latrice Royale, Trinity Taylor, and Willem. It's time for the immunity challenge slash reward challenge. And this one involves having to make as many golf balls disappear. We don't want to know how. And the winner was Courtney Act. So congratulations, Courtney. This is her second consecutive individual immunity win. And she got to share an awesome reward, which was a dinner that involved one mint with Ginger Minge and Willem. It seems like Trinity Taylor and Willem who previously turned on their alliance partner, Trixie Mattel, have now kind of targeted Detox. So, hmm, we'll see. Also, this giant alliance must turn on each other if they're gonna ever make anything work. Going into this tribal council, because Ginger Minge has the legacy advantage, any votes cast against Ginger do not count this time. 
And because it's the last opportunity for Trinity to use the Hidden Immunity Idol, Trinity also uses the Hidden Immunity Idol, and any votes cast against Trinity don't count either. It's time for us to read the votes. First vote, Detox. Second vote, Willem. Third vote, Willem. Fourth vote, Detox. Fifth vote, Willem. Sixth vote, Detox. We're at a tie. And because we're at a tie, rocks are going to be drawn again. This is like the whole Ceri situation if you watched Survivor Game Changers. Only it was a lot more tragic for Ceri. And the person that has been eliminated from this game because of a rock draw is... Latrice Royale! Oh my goodness! Oh, so Latrice Royale, I'm so sorry. You have been voted out. You weren't even voted out. There was no votes against you. You've been rock drawn out of Drag Queen Survivor. I'm so sorry. Please sashay away down that dock, honey. Damn, these votes though. Everyone's turning on one another. This is about to be spicy. Interesting that Willem and Trinity did not work together and Trinity did turn on her alliance partner and voted to get Willem out. Willem's not gonna be happy about that. The final five, episode number 16. We are so close to the end. And it's time for the final five immunity challenge. And this one involves trying to get the most dick pics you can from Grinder. And easily, Willem just smokes the entire competition, literally and figuratively. And Willem has won this individual immunity. Now, because Courtney Act did not win this individual immunity, Courtney might be in trouble here. Now, it is interesting that Trinity and Willem might still work together, even though Trinity tried to get Willem out last time. I don't know how that conversation went. I don't even want to know. But it seems like there's a lot of different alliances that are uh, targeting several people, but the most targeted person seems to be Courtney Act. But two final targets are Courtney Act or Trinity Taylor. It's time to read the votes. First vote, Detox. Second vote, Courtney. Third vote, Courtney. Fourth vote, Courtney. And just like I said, Courtney Act, you have been voted out of Drag Queen Survivor. Girl, you lasted a long time, but I think you only lasted as long as you did because of those immunity wins. So, sashay away, take your heels with you, and carry your wigs, and please don't put them where I think you're going to be putting them. The final four of Drag Queen Survivor, Detox, Ginger Minge, Trinity Taylor, and Willem. If that doesn't sound like a shit show, I don't know what does. Just kidding, they are all amazing. Go check them all out if you haven't already. And in the final four, Individual Immunity Challenge, which involves a huge gauntlet, including putting down your lace front wigs, putting on makeup, blowing a guy in the bathrooms, and performing on a stage, Willem is able to come out on top. Surprisingly, top, right? Um, Willem has won individual immunity, which means Willem is for sure going to make it to the final three and be in the finale to help the jury figure out who the winner is. If you don't know what Survivor and how it works, basically there's a jury and they help decide the winner. You'll see, you'll see. And with the votes cast, first vote, Detox. Second vote, Ginger. Third vote, Trinity. And the fourth vote, Trinity. And it seems like Willem has, I don't know if Willem did vote, but I'm assuming Willem turned on Trinity and Trinity the Tuck Taylor, the tribe has spoken. You know, for a season nine girl, Trinity, you lasted a long time and you were shady as hell. You were turning on Alliance partners left and right, but sadly you were too much of a threat in the final three and you had to go. So sashay away, mama. Interesting, Willem did not turn on Trinity and instead it was Detox and Ginger that work together to get Willem's friend Trinity out. So it is time for the final tribal council. We have our final three, Detox, Ginger Minge, and Willem. And we've got our jury who will help decide who the winner is, which consists of Adore Delano, Alaska, Alyssa, Courtney Act, Kim Chi, Latrice Royale, Shangela, Tatiana, Trinity the Tuck Taylor, and Trixie Mattel. One of those three at the very top will be winning this game. Let's see who it's going to be. It's time to reveal the votes. First vote, Detox. Second vote, Willem. Third vote, Ginger Minge. Fourth vote, Willem. Fifth vote, Detox. Sixth vote, Ginger Minge. Seventh vote, Willem. Eighth vote, Detox. Ninth vote, Willem. Tenth vote, Willem, which does mean congratulations, Willem. You are the winner of Drag Queen Survivor. 
you beat out all 19 other contestants in this crazy drag queen survival island game, and you managed to take the top spot. Congratulations, Willem. Who did you think was going to win this? I had a lot of fun doing this. If you want me to do more of these in the future with more people or something like that, let me know in the comments down below. If you're new here, hit that sub button. I, I do weird things, especially on Twitch, twitch.tv slash 8 and go check me out. And once again, congratulations, Willem. Go check out Willem. If you've not checked out any of the other contestants, go check them out as well. My name's 8 Dylan. I'll see you guys in the future with another video. And until then, stay awesome, stay beautiful, you lovely people. Bye-bye. Actually, before I leave real quick, let's see what these jury votes were. Adore voted for Willem to win. Alaska voted for Willem. Courtney voted for Willem. Latrice voted for Willem and Trixie Mattel voted for Willem. Here are all the votes, just so you guys wanna know what the jury votes were. Oh, and apparently the fan favorite award went to Pandora. She left so early, but okay.